Hello, I'm Robert Chait from Brazil, uh, sailing uh, since I was nine years old. Uh, did 15 years of laser sailing and eight years of star sailing. Went to five Olympic Games and many world championships. Uh, yeah, we're here in uh, Nassau in Bahamas for the Star Sailors League. Uh, we're very happy to to come to this event. I think it's going to be a great regatta. And uh, well. Regarding your question, I think uh, sailing is a very complex sport. It's a sport that is not only about the training and about the about the physical fitness. There's many factors that involves uh, because you're dealing with uh, with the wind, you're dealing with the current, we're dealing with the competition. So I think the most important thing is that you really enjoy sailing, and then you can learn each day that you go to the water. That when you come back from the water, you will make mistakes, and that you can improve from that mistakes for the next day. I think that that's what makes you better and better day by day, that you, that you, that you can take something out of a, out of a day. Uh, after the London Olympics, uh, who haven't been on a star too much, uh, I went back to the laser and Bruno, my crew, went to the fin. So we haven't really uh, trained so much for this regatta, but uh, we hope we can do well, you know. We're gonna give it our best chance and uh, it's probably going to be a regatta that uh, consistent sailing will pay off, like good starts, uh, bo good boat handling, and good boat speed and good tactics. That's what wins regattas like this. And uh, hopefully we can uh, do well, qualify in the top 10, which is the, our primary goal to go in the final day. And then hopefully in the final day we can uh, make some good racing. Talent alone doesn't doesn't win you anything, and uh, only hard work also not. So I think you gotta have a fair bit of talent, but also you gotta work really hard. You know, if I look back when I started sailing Optimus, there were guys that were more talented than me, but they didn't uh, move forward. You know, they didn't go to Olympic classes. They decided to do other things in life, and I kept pushing and pushing and pushing. And at one stage, the door opened for me. I won my first world championship with 22 years old and uh, that gave me a lot of confidence. Uh, if I look back, I wouldn't expect me to, if, with 40 years old, to be winning so many regattas, you know, and to be so successful. So I'm pretty happy because it's, sailing is the thing I love most in my life and to be, to be able to do it as a job, it's great, you know. We travel to great places and uh, we have good friends all around and uh, the competition really motivates me. Uh, we, you just try to develop your potential to, to the maximum, you know, I think that that's when you, when you finish each each athlete when you when you're done when you finish your career you want to look back and say I gave my best and I I developed my potential to, to the maximum possible if that was to win a national championship or a world championship it doesn't matter It's that important that you reach the maximum potential and That's that's one that what my goal is, you know, I don't know how how much more I can uh, can be at the top of how many more years but right now I'm enjoying it a lot my body still letting me do it and uh, I mean it's it's great it's a great sport it's uh, a sport that you never get bored because one day is always different than the other you know one day you have light winds other day strong winds you always make some mistakes that you want to improve for the next day and uh, sailing in different classes is also great you know you go from the lasers a single handed you sail you have to make all decisions alone and then you come to the star sailors league you sail on a double handed boat me and bruno and you have to split the decisions it's a more complicated boat so it all adds up to your knowledge i think they picked the perfect place you know at this time of the year december Everybody's freezing and uh, we're here in this, this paradise. It's my first time here and uh, I'm lucky, you know, because uh, probably it was uh, the, my best chance to come here was to do a, a sailing regatta like this and uh, I think it's going to be great.